Hello folks, LJ here, coming at you live. Quick, check off your calendars, it's December 28th. Today's an important day. So what day is it? I'll give you a couple seconds to think about it. <sighs> Done. Today, December 28th, is my one year anniversary of being on YouTube. Yeah! Quite a momentous occasion. So, it's already been a year since I joined YouTube. Man, how time flies. It's been a year since I uploaded my first video. That pointless, boring, somewhat crappy, trying too hard to be funny video titled Introduction to My Channel. <sighs> I can look back on it in both a nostalgic sense and a mortified sense. Back then I was filming in a completely different house, completely different room, didn't have an editing software. In fact, it was kind of nice because upon making my YouTube channel, I already knew what I wanted to do. Because after watching such reviewers as Big Boy Reviews, Mr. Wild Boy 94 and Kanto 1408, not to sound cheesy, but I was inspired. I just wanted to get my own personal opinion on a book or movie out to the public perhaps give different insight on a book somebody had already read, or, more importantly, introduce somebody to a new favorite book or movie. In fact, I distinctly remember getting hooked on Mr. Wildboy 94's extensive horror book review collection. Then I gradually branched out and discovered book reviews held a much larger niche on YouTube than I'd previously thought. In fact, to get this, people actually enjoyed other people's opinions on books and movies, so much so that they actually subscribed to that person. That was a completely new thought to me. I thought most people, upon viewing a young kid just going through puberty, filming in a dimly lit room, and harping on about whichever books and movies he decided to watch, would be shunned and ignored. I honestly had no idea I would be where I am today, had no idea reviewing would be so ingrained into my lifestyle. In fact, whenever I read something new or watch something new, I almost automatically, without noticing, start to think about how can I review this? What are my thoughts on this? I start organizing a smorgasbord of details and opinions in my mind, and then it eventually works its way into being an actual review here on YouTube. And honestly, YouTube has been very kind to me. I've had limited issues with trolls. Over the months, more or less, I've amassed a cult following of very kind-hearted individuals. Everyone has their own unique, different insights on works. They let me know kindly in the comments below. I consider them. I'm always open to different methods of thinking. And to be quite frank, some of these people have gone even further than just being YouTube acquaintances, followers, They've sort of entered into my life on a more personal level through Twitter or Facebook. And I'm very happy and grateful to have these people in my life, these people that I can relate to, all these people living in different parts of the country, yet able to come together through social media. It's an extraordinary experience. And I remember gradually, painstakingly gaining subscribers. I celebrated when I hit 10 subscribers, people. I never thought I'd be where I am now within a year, within two years, within three years. Yet something about my views and thoughts, the way I compose myself on camera, attracts people's attention. They actually enjoy watching and listening to me. <laughs> can you believe that? I can now, without hesitation, strongly say, I am a YouTuber. And just throwing it out there, I plan to be filming and uploading videos to YouTube for the rest of my life to review and do many other things on camera as long as I can. Because it's now become part of who I am, what makes me as a person. I think YouTube has improved my speaking skills, my logic, and the way I think. It's so much more than just a website, but sorry I'm rambling on, I'm just reminiscing about the great year I've had with all of you guys, my subscribers. And seeing how this is probably going to be my last uploaded video of this year, 2012, I'm going to present my year-end YouTube statistics, stuff that really boggles my mind. Courtesy of SocialBlade.com's YouTube stats, if you've not checked out that site, I heartily recommend you do. It's SocialBlade.com. And now these stats will obviously change as people inevitably view this video, enjoy it. But these are just the numbers I have on my channel at this very moment. Within the past year, I've uploaded 72 videos. I've amassed 140 subscribers, still amazed with that number, and I've received just over 10,000 video views, 
So folks, with that being said, thank you all. It's all been made possible because of you, the viewer. And so just stay with me, faithful viewer, as we travel into uncharted territory, the year 2013. It's a new front, a new start. Who knows what will happen in the new year? But whatever happens, I'm sure you'll continue to amaze me. I've seen what has been made possible through a year's time. I have complete confidence that we can hit 400 subscribers by this time next year. So let's make it happen. Spread the word about my channel. And oh yeah, for your convenience, I've added something a little new to my channel's description. It's basically just a list of any upcoming movie slash book related reviews that may arise. So check that out. Tell me what you think. I love the feedback. And as many of you know, I also have a second YouTube channel titled LJ Zinda Vlogs. My second channel, not as popular, not quite as many videos are uploaded to it. Videos will continue to be uploaded to my vlog channel though, naturally as this right here is my main channel, the brunt of my videos will be located here. If you want the best that I have to offer, this is the place to go. And I guess the only advice I have to give to you now is to sit down, buckle the hell in, and prepare for more fun and informative videos in the upcoming months. As always, if you enjoy what you're seeing, please like, comment, and subscribe. Lend me your thoughts in the comment box below. Stay safe, take care of this New Year's, and I'll see you in 2013. Bye.